Welcome to the first cynical channel. Today I would like to tell you about the life of a Russian man. I'm 36 years old, I'm a man and I live in a kind of hell. In the Russian hell. It's unlikely that I will be living more than 60 years. Probably not more than 50. Do I fear death? No. Death for Russian men is a deliverance. This is an endless vacation. It's an escape from a madhouse. Most of the Russian men live in poverty. Perhaps you've heard that the average salary in Russia is about 500 euros. It's a lie. The average salary consists of huge incomes of 1% of the richest population and beggarly salaries of 99% of other people. For example, the teacher's salary at the institute can be slightly more than 200 euros, and the rector's, 10,000 euros. And of course, the average salary will be good. Only what is the use of the average salary for a teacher who receives 200 euros? Prices in Russia are comparable to those in Central Europe. Medicine practically does not function in Russia. The work of doctors is built in such a way that it is not beneficial for the doctor to treat patients. You may not be given even a first aid. They may use disposable medical products several times. But there is a distortion of reporting in order to show a good level of medicine on paper. The majority of men do not reach the age of 60 years. The main cause of death are cardiovascular diseases. Although recently they started talking about the specific cause of men's death. Without any particular disease, middle-aged men die, because there is no point in living for them. Usually a Russian man cannot stand hard work for 10 to 12 hours a day. That's how much he has to work to match the image of a real man. A real man is an artificially created image for the purpose of exploiting a man. A real man works for 12 hours a day, gives almost all the money earned to a woman, suffers women's infidelity, and in general he is more alike cattle. A many try to become a real man. Their lives lose actual meaning, they die, and their women are trying to find themselves the next real men. In Russia, a very high level of crime. They steal everything. If you are robbed, the police are very reluctant to accept the application. They do not want to spoil the statistics. The main part of criminality goes in seracy. In general, the struggle against criminality is a separate topic. In Russia, the killer gets three to seven years in prison. The burglar cannot go to jail at all. Almost everything you hear about Russia from the Russian media is a lie. In Russia there is very strong propaganda. Untruth is all around. There are huge amounts of budget money to hide the truth. This is a short excursion into the life of the Russian man. I hope you enjoyed it. If you are interested in this topic, write in the comments that you would like to hear in more detail. And rejoice that you do not live in Russia.